Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Heroes of Might and Magic 3. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that you chose to join me today here in uh, the, the last mission of the Undead campaign. I think it is the last mission, I'm pretty sure it is. And we're going around trying to survive against these terrible, terrible skeletons of death, because they're very nasty and deadly. Not too much, actually. It's going relatively okay, but this mission... We are up, but we're basically two cities up against, uh, let's wait over here, yes, up against four of them, I think. So, it can turn out quite badly for us. Let's attack you here, attack you there, get two skeletons dead on our side, wait over there, and get you killed like that. And we don't get any skeletons from here, which is terrible! Advanced wisdom, that's very important. Basic earth magic, not so much. Uh, but we're trying to collect as many resources as possible, all the things that one does in a situation such as this. Uh, and I'm waiting for resources. We'll see what we're gonna spend, but I think I'm okay with not spending anything right now. Because... Oh, these guys are coming. I think. Because we're, we have this over here. So, uh, because this town, and it's the last day of the week, because this town is the one that actually is making... Oh, yeah. Base creature growth improvement. I also want this. But I want this more. So I'll go with that. And that's gonna wreck havoc in our things. So I want the estate that requires the graveyard. The graveyard I can make. Uh, all of these require the graveyard and things. Aww. That, that kinda sucks, because that means I can do all the things. Aww. I have a lot of this thing. I don't know, I, I don't know that I need that. The, 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 the mercury. Eh, well, I needed to come over here anyway. Because, you know, we're gonna get more more units um, and then you are gonna get more units over here as well uh, everything seems to be in order we're gonna wait until next uh, next day we have a uh, mystical garden over here for a little bit of money we're gonna get the rest of the money tomorrow we have a lot of stuff to see I think uh, generally we're doing a good job let's see what the week is this time around the week of the dog fortunately dogs well the uh, cobalts I think aren't a thing in this game, so everything is good and nobody is bothering me. And uh, you're gonna get that over there. I think this is for... A Ring of Life. That's pretty amazing. That is pretty amazing. It adds life to all units. That is very good. And we also have things over here that are uh, easy to get. A pack, a pack of Cerberi over there can be quite nasty. Yeah, I should be able to kill them. Am I? Pack of vampires is a, wor is a worse thing. I might be able to get the vampires that are coming out of here. So, let's first look at this town and see what we can build. We have the mausoleum over here for liches. We have the estate for vampires. And we also have the upgrades. Well, we're gonna need a bunch of things anyway, so I'm gonna go with that uh, and see what we can do. So we're gonna get all of these and all of our money is gone. At least we could buy everything, so nothing bad happen there. Skeletons are going to be very helpful, hopefully. And the rest of you are basically going to deal with other things. we got a crypt over there that we need to fight. Uh, we have also some skeletons up there. I think... I think it's okay if I split. But uh, it, it, it might not be. It might not be okay. I don't know. That, that's... I just don't know. Let's see what I can do here. Uh, we got some liches coming in. We have... Uh, they are very expensive, so I don't think I can buy them all. I can buy them all. Yes, I can. They also are very funny. What are they doing? They move? What were... They're not very funny, but they do have different animations. They had like the sort of... That was a weird... Like they were tripping or something. I don't know. It might have been that one. Uh, let's see what I can do over here. Got a resource silo. Uh, Hall of Darkness for Black Knights. That's gonna basically wreck uh, our money may or our... Uh, not money making, our um, unit making. And I do need to go up there. How do I get up there? With a boat. Well, that's what I need to do. So, let's get um, the units we can. Leeches are gonna be very helpful. Uh, let's go with a balanced one. I'll, I'll go with all the liches. So get that, and I have none over here, some over there. 
Just want all the skeletons if I can. Can't get that many, but that's good. The, the leeches are going to be helpful. Um, so I'll just go over there and see how that turns out. As for you, you're waiting because I might be joining both armies. You're level 3, you're level 2, but you're a necromancer, so uh, let's get you over here. Yeah, let's join both armies. See how that works. So you give everything. Good. Uh, and that's that. Uh, and then you're gonna go over there and get the money. But first you kill these guys. No, look at that. We don't have strategy or anything. We do have some spells. I'm gonna send you up. Unfortunately, well, we'll see. I don't know if they're gonna be able to get to the uh, Cerberi. They are not gonna be able to get to the Cerberi. That sucks. That's 15 skeletons gone. And he's... Oh, no, we're dead. No, we're not. I was looking at the wrong thing. Uh, I have magic arrows that are going to be able to do some damage, but these, these guys are pretty strong. Uh, curse. Should have cast Curse. Are they... Whew, I should have cast Curse. Yeah, yeah. I should have definitely cast Curse. So, move you up there. Move you over here, just basically swarm them. Uh, I don't know if swarming them is a good... Oh, no. Dang it. Why am I an idiot? I need to cast Curse before. Okay, so move you guys up there. Swarming them is not a good idea because they... Um, they um, they will attack us all, like them too. So seven skeletons died. You can attack and not get a retribution and a critical as well, so that's really nice. Uh, I'm going to get a magic arrow in the face over there. Or I'm going to give him a magic arrow. And this should be able to kill a bunch of them, if not all of them. Oh, that was a stupid decision. That was a stupid decision. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Killed one of my vampires. Seven skeletons for that. That sucked. That just sucked. I don't have money for anything else. Oh, they're through. Oh, the are they through? Oh, yeah, they're through. Oh, that... So you have... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, no, I have lost... I have lost. Well, I have so lost. The best I can pull off is get a few liches over here for the moment. And then try to get you over here. I mean, this is going to be a, a tricky fight because it's vampires. <laughs> the jerks. Ah, the jerks. They're very, very healthy. Okay, let's attack you. Let's attack you. Let's attack you over here. You don't do anything. There it is. So it is it is a fair amount of loss over there. But we might be able to get back in time. So you're going to collect the rest of the stuff. Get a little bit of extra money. I mean, the extra money is going to help. But it's most... I need here as well. I need things up here. Hall of Darkness for all this stuff. And get this producing in things. Definitely need that. What are you doing? Don't do... Don't get... No. Don't get my things. What is this? I've dumped in there. Okay, so th those guys are gone. Because this is a pretty powerful army. As for you, you might actually be... That's lost several... Yeah, we might be able to track you down and kill you. What are you trying to do? You didn't get anything for you yet. Hmm. I'll go I'll go after you. I mean, it's not a, the best army that I have. But it is an army. And their army might just be... Just, you know, so that they can do anything. 
And we're getting a lot of good things here as well. A lot of good uh, weapons and equipment. Uh, I might want to go there. Mm, I'm not really sure how, what is going to happen. Uh, over on this side we have this, which is going to help us make very high level or higher level units. Up here we have, well not much, I need the Dragon Vault, but that's going to take a long while to get. The Resource Silo would be a good thing, Skeleton Transformer, not so much. The rest of the stuff can wait, because we are out of money. What are you doing? Can I get to you? Yes, I can. Are you dead? Maybe. That was tactical phase. Um, yeah, I think you are. Are you a spellcaster or something? I don't know. Uh, let's try... I don't know. Let's... Oh, yeah, you are. You absolute jerk. I'm gonna want to kill you. Okay. Try to kill you here. Mm, that's gonna do a little bit of damage. But that's all in the hopes... Oh, I didn't want that. Oh, didn't want that either. Oh! And we got the ev ev evapor e e no 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 ever pouring v vial of mercury. That's amazing. And the oh there oh that's fantastic. The ring of infinite gems. That's giving us things already. Basic wisdom or advanced intelligence. I'll go, I'll go with basic wisdom. Le learning higher level spells is pretty important. Uh, that is pretty awesome. The crypt is gonna have uh, and we got eleven things over there. Yeah. Uh, what is that up there? That's a lo lots of Walking Dead. I'll need a lot of things. I'll need a lot of things, and I do need to go up there, but that is a victory, a definite victory for sure. Uh, as for you, you're going back. Wherever you go, it's fine, because we're just going to give some uh, units over. As for you, we got a, a pack of vampires. We're probably going to need to buy that. Um, okay, let's get you over there. That's good. Probably going to need to pay a bunch of money, which is a shame. So we got some vampires coming in. I'll wait. And then we can do some damage over wherever. Might cast haste on, on the vampires. On my vampires. I'm going to wait with you. Or defend, rather. I'm going to defend with you. I'll attack over here, because it doesn't matter. Uh, I'll cast haste on you, because they're going to attack twice because of that. Oh, that kind of sucks. But at least I got an attack off. And that was pretty cool, actually. Okay, that was that's very nice. Skeletons can get the haste. I don't think it's necessary. Because the vampires go in and finish the job. No casualties. And can't afford to purchase a boat. Yes, I can. I just need to sell some things. Do I have Marketplace? Uh, I don't think I do, actually. Have I bought the market? I Because, oh, I do have a marketplace. Do you buy things? Yes, you do. But it's very bad prices. That said, I think it is a better deal than... I think it is a better deal than actually buying a hero and sending the hero to a marketplace. It sucks. But I don't have too much need for this. And I don't need all that much money either, so it is okay. 28 for 2100. That's not even how many I need. Oh, wait a minute. That's weird. Okay, yeah. So now I have enough money. It's wood that I need. Ah, uh, well. Uh, well, it's it's not too bad. It's not too bad. What, what can I build over here? Uh, we got the Dragon Vault. Yeah, spend all the money. Spell, spend all the things. We'll wait. We'll wait. Having the Dragon Vault is, is good. So yeah, I'm waiting. Uh, so it's wood that we're missing, basically. Uh, maybe... Yeah, definitely. Ju for right now, it is wood. Uh, so you're going down there. No, you're really going down there. You are uh, giving your items over. Uh, all of them. All of them are equipped. Everything is amazing. 
I guess we can have that. What's that? Yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, that's pretty... What's that one? Defense skills. Yeah, just really good stuff in general. And then you can go around getting stuff like Scuttleboat, Scuttleboat, and we haven't been up here yet, yet with you, so might as well do that. So I don't have wood. That kind of sucks. I, the thing is, I don't know how expensive it is. I think it is 10,000 gold plus 10 wood. It might be plus, it, plus 20 wood. I just don't know. Do I want to go here? Yes, let's do some fighting. Uh, vampires at the front. Liches at the back. You get at the front. That's actually a bad place for you. Get you over here. Okay. So vampires at the front are gonna wait a little bit. They don't have ranged units, so you need to die fast. Let's see how much damage I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill you. That's how much damage I do. Okay, and then you wait. These guys are all prepared and ready. But the vampires are gonna teach them. So I should be okay here with you. Uh, I'm gonna be okay here with you. And I'm gonna defend with you. And you guys go in there and attack these ones, because they are really nasty and hurt. So that was... How many did I kill? Four zombies. How many are there? 16 now. Okay. Uh, I can kill you there. And wait. And then you can do a lot of damage. But I can wait. How many are there? I mean, is that a good idea? No. I mean, this might be a better idea. I'm not gonna kill them all, though. So I'm gonna defend. We got the vampires that don't get retribution. I think my liches go first. If they do, well, these guys are gone. Oh, they do. Yeah. Oh, perfect. They're very slow, the zombies. Uh, basic water magic or expert artillery. Let's go with water magic. And we have access to a new area. So you don't have any magic so far. Okay. Uh, we have a lighthouse, which is important. And I will go for it, because we are going to need some of that. We also have the windmill that might have been visited already. Because I do know that the enemies were going around here. Uh, that's fine. It's not too bad. Uh, then up here, I am waiting for these down there. So actually, for here, I have all of the units. I can make all of them, so we're basically producing at maximum capacity. Uh, that's really nice. Uh, what will I need? Resource silo? Yes, we'll go with that. And then over here, we're not going to be able... Well, we are going to be... Oh, yeah, definitely. Earth graves. Get those skeletons producing. Okay. I think I think we're in a really good position. I thought for a moment it was going to be bad, but, I mean, it was just a simple army. Ah, oh, nothing over there. I did well in not, not doing anything. Uh, what? Sure. 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 That's a thing. That's definitely a thing that just happened. Uh, let's get you over there. Not today, apparently. Let's get you up here and right there. As for units, it is day seven, so we want... Uh, unfortunately, we can't uh, make any new things. Uh, well, I, it's only the dragon that's missing on here. So, that's that's that town is really nice, actually. It's doing really well. This is the Bone Dragon's place? It looks like a solar-powered thingy. <laughs> it's weird. Skeleton Transformer up there would be nice. Start to get these things going, maybe. I don't know. I, I don't think it's it's necessary for right now. Uh, the Week of the Hedgehog. That's nice. Hedgehogs are really cute. And they uh, they also make weird noises. When I was a kid, uh, we always had cats in my house. And um, our cats are sort of... They're, we put them outside. And they eat outside. If they need to, they, need to, they can eat rodents and all that sort of stuff. Uh, they're, they're outside cats because we it's like a it's a house so it's not like a flat or anything um, but when I was a kid I definitely remember I was about four or five I was really really small um, and uh, let's see this is a pretty awesome thing if I can get these guys I sort of can yeah that's pretty good I can get some more skeletons these are always nice to have um, and I was really small and my dad showed me let's see I need to go down there going over here could be good though yeah let's go over there 
um, showed me some, um, so like a thing outside that I didn't know uh, what it was because I, I couldn't figure it out. I, I don't know. I saw. I I wasn't very good at, of eyesight when I was a kid. I only I was only diagnosed when I was seven, I think. Um, and uh, you have very little. Very little uh, army, so I'm not gonna do much over there. I can't really do much with you at this point. Mm, let's just go back. Uh, and so he pointed out through the window, uh, you know, morning. It was daytime, um, but I, you know, like it was out, it's sun, uh, sunny outside. But I couldn't figure I couldn't figure it out. It just I, I saw a rock or something. I, I'm I was probably not even looking at the right place. And I thought, hey, those are hedgehogs. That's that's what they are. And I was like, what? I don't, what? I, I can't. Uh, and I didn't, I didn't understand. But the, that very week, I guess it was, the, I guess in hindsight, it was the same hedgehogs that we were looking at that day. Um, I was uh, out, the, that was in the night. I was uh, outside and uh, I was watching the cats or playing with the cats or something. And they were eating because they had like this little thingy, whether they eat, just, you know, how cats do. You know, just have a place for them to eat and things. Um, and I was looking, I was there, and then I saw this other thing next to the the cats. And the cats weren't really too bothered with it, and it was the size of, like, a small cat. And it was all spiky and stuff. And I didn't know where he was, and I went up to it, and he didn't, fl didn't flee. I was, like, four, so I wasn't too big or anything. It was just eating, uh, and I was like, I, I, didn't, I didn't know what it was. So I, I touched it to do some petting, and I remember, I distinctly remember that uh, that nothing bad happened the first time but it got all like flustery and all all the spikes all over the place and all that sort of stuff so it definitely knew I don't like this and I imagine it stopped eating for some uh, for that I don't remember noticing it but I imagine it did and then I, w I went to pet it again because I didn't know what it was so I was like what what's this I don't what uh, and I didn't know what it was and I went to pet it again and now with the spikes all spiked up I just stabbed myself immediately with spikes, and I just, I didn't like it, I guess I cried out or something. And, ooh, look at that, a lot of wood, that's great. And it's a brand new week, so we probably can start working on upgrades up here. I would like to upgrade the other town, though. This town has been producing some things. It doesn't have as many of these guys as, as, as that up there. I guess it, it's not a bad thing. Let's, let's start with these guys. Yeah. And as for you, maybe start with the cheap ones. Yeah. Yeah, because these guys have been producing, those cheaper ones up here have been producing for longer, so I think we have more. Even though it's going to take a long while until we actually arrive there. Uh, this can, I can get on my way back. We have some sirens. I think that is a nice thing to have. And not terrible, that's going to kill us all. But I also don't want to go there right now. I'm going to go up there. Let's see what that's all about. I want to get as many resources as possible as early on as possible. So I, cr I probably uh, could just to finish the hedgehog story. I, I, I probably cried out. And uh, my mom came in the wall and, and saw and she explained what that was. And because uh, she, she didn't know. And apparently, uh, the, I don't remember more, but apparently the hedgehogs, the hedgehogs would um, regularly, let's just save, regularly show up to steal food from the cats. And uh, the cats wouldn't bother them, so they probably, the pro the, the hedgehogs probably um, dealt with the cats, or rather, the cats probably dealt with the hedgehogs quite regularly, so they knew what they were and just didn't mind. Uh, let's see, you guys are gonna have trouble. Let's get you on this side, because those guys are not gonna kill you. Okay, so that's a lot of damage right there. Let's go for it. Yeah, that's pretty good. And they didn't die, which is great. Oh, uh, oh, that's fine. Nobody's gonna die there. That's gonna be skeletons. Six skeletons dead. We're actually gonna get a bunch of skeletons from here. Because... Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Because that way I would have attacked with them. And I lost two skeletons because of that. How many skeletons do we get? Maybe none? I mean, you're a necromancer. Why aren't you getting... Why aren't you getting better? 50 skeletons. That's the one. And we got a bunch of other things. So I... You have found... Oh, it's just a cache. It's not actually, like, uh, an imp recruitment center. That's fine. Let's let's get out of here. Yeah, so apparently they, they kept showing up, but I don't remember finding uh, seeing them again, the hedgehogs. Um, 
I remember that time. Maybe I do remember seeing them again or not. But yeah, hedgehogs that uh, eat, eat with my cats. I pro it's probably very common. Uh, but that that's that's my story about the week of the hedgehog. And I will say hedgehog. But that's because it's weird and I don't really understand words very well. Or cats. Or hedgehogs. Or dogs. These guys are coming, aren't they? You're gonna steal that from me, aren't you, you jerk? Well, I have just a fix. So, I want... I want that, to be honest. I want this as well. Oh, that's so expensive, though. That is so expensive. Okay, probably want vampires. How many do we have? Not that many. Liches, not that many either. Uh, I'll go with that. So, I will put you over there, and I will get these, these, and these. And that, can't, okay. And these then. Yeah. And this is our army, and we're gonna go and get it. Get that guy, because... He's annoying me. Uh, and as for you, we're gonna have a little bit of a fight over here. Hopefully. Okay, this should be okay. We have done a similar thing, I think. Let's get you over here. Let's see what happens to these guys. Okay, you wait. Aw, oh, that kind of sucks. Let's move you up, because they're not gonna get us. Uh, let's move you up. So the idea here is to kill you as soon as possible. No, it's to kill those. Five skeletons dead, not a problem. And we wait, these guys show up and we kill them all. Didn't actually look at how much damage it would do. I figured we were gonna kill them all, but we got 24, okay. That's, that's definitely worth it. And these guys haven't done a very good job of getting all of these things. So yay, and let's see what we have. This is so much stuff back here. Although I'm finding nothing. A little bit of money. Recanter's Cloak. You've pulled a shipwreck survivor from certain death in an unforgiving ocean. Grateful he rewards you for your act of kindness by giving you the Reencanter's Cloak. And uh, you will be able to cast level 3 or higher spells during combat. Oh, neither you nor your opponent will be able to cast that. So that kind of works. If you're if you suck at spell casting. Oh, I'm not paying attention to what we're getting there. I probably should. Getting a lot of money. Uh let's see. So I want yeah, probably that. It's cheap enough that it definitely is worth it. Although, yeah, that's good enough. That's good enough. And that's good enough for this episode as well, because we're out of time for the day. So for right now, I'm Kirill RPG, and this has been Heroes of Mighty Magic 3. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.